Family and friends, we gather here today in this beautiful place. And as we stand in the presence of God's creation and the love that God has shown to this beautiful couple, you know, we just stand in, in amazement and, and in honor you know, to have this ability and this joy to come together as one body, as one witness, to see two lives come together. Sister Bro, that you have the pleasure now of seeing God's world through for the first time every time as one flesh. So every experience will be a new and fresh one, and every day an opportunity to be conformed to the greater likeness of the Lord, and to be even more powerful instrument of His grace. So I'll be cheering you both on as you both strive to live out God's truth, being that picture of Jesus and His love for us in the church. May you be nothing but servants to one another and loving founders of a family who lives under Jesus' name. I love you both. So my sweet potato, I vow to live out the truth of God's word with you as your wife. If people don't know what it looks like or what it means that God created marriage specifically, to be a reflection of Jesus' love for his church. I pray our union together as one will strive for this truth and that we will be able to give others that picture of Jesus and the church through our marriage. With humility, honor, zeal, and love. Let us make God look good together, baby. <laughs> Can't wait to do this with you. You're the sweetest ever, and that's why you're my sweet potato. And God did such a good job. I love you, but God loves you more. <laughs> Let's take a deep breath and enjoy this moment. God's uniting us. Isn't that crazy? Hope this gift makes your day, our day, a little more perfect than it already is. I love you, my baby. It's time to get married. That face, that glow. You can't hold back when you know you know. And I know that I love you. Can't hide it. I was born to love. I'm so excited and so nervous at the same time, but I know that the Lord has us in His good hands. I can't wait to see what's in store for the both of us and how God is going to use us for His kingdom. His story for us as husband and wife begins today. I love you plenty. Honey, honey, Sam. Cause you be that guy. I'm beginning to understand more and more of what it means to be a man of God when I'm with you. Now, we're not just little kids anymore. We're kids with tuxes and dresses. <laughs> and I pray that our childlike faith will never age. On this day, I vow as your husband and hopefully one day future father of our children to steward our relationship towards loving God. I vow to steward our future children towards our God. Samantha, my baby, I vow as your husband to love you 
as my wife, as Christ loved the church and gave himself up for her. All I know is how I feel And all I want is what is real Tonight, I will be retiring as his doubles partner in Halo and in Fortnite. Sam, just be sure you have a strong back to carry him as your partners in doubles and in life. Everybody, let's make a toast. Congratulations to the new Mrs. and Mr. George and Sam Riglos. Very proud. It's a new succeed in life, and I'm so proud of you. May the Lord bless, richly bless you both with many children. Congratulations. Trust is very important to her, another, and loyal so that two of you can open up anything so avoid lying so your relationship will not fade away always be truthful god created a day for everyone here to gather and witness the love relationship between jesus and the church and how complex that may sound, we get to see a small glimpse of it in the marriage union of George and I. This is what God creates, and He is good to us, not because we are good and perfect, but because He is, and that's God's character. And we hope to do well together. May you live your life as Christ lived his life. May you love one another as Christ loved us. And may you give to one another all that you can as Christ did as well. Therefore, what God has joined together, let man not put us under. Power vested in me in the state of Hawaii, and I'll pronounce this man and this woman as one couple, one loving couple, George and Sam Riggles. You may kiss the bride.